and welcome to the Casual Chef's Kitchen. It's Saturday morning, which means I have been to the Yuba City Certified Farmer's Market. Technically, this is the last weekend, or the last Saturday, but some of the growers are going to go an extra two weeks. And I look forward to seeing those growers. Okay. I took last night off because Robin was out of town. And so we pushed the butter chicken to today. Yesterday, when I was out running an errand, um, getting Betty washed, um, I went over to La um, LA, uh, <laughs> LA Merchandise and picked up some, some flatbreads for tonight. I decided to make Black Doll. Now, I couldn't remember, <laughs> I must put it, the last time I made this, which was years ago, because I only saw my former wife make it. Um, she had no recipes. So I did the research. Um, I got a nice, very nice um, black Urad doll recipe. Um, it's Punjabi style. Um, yeah, it's going to be fun. I have had the the black doll soaking since yesterday morning. Several of the recipes I looked at required a pressure cooker. I don't have one. So, and it's like I, said, I mentioned before, I'm doing butter chicken. So let's get to what I've got going on behind me. I got the hardware. And we're going to skip all that and that. Saw my buddy Corey this morning um, from Auburn, the, my mushroom guy. He, these are chestnut mushrooms. I'm going to be using them in a uh, mushroom and rice dish later on this week. These look wonderful. Picked up a little basket of fresh jalapenos. There's a couple colored ones in there. There's a red one. It looks like a purple. That's Yeah. Um, great deal. Some sweet basil. Um, this is going to be dried. I'm going to, I'm stocking up. Picked up some fresh cilantro. Um, I'm actually going to put this in a, in a water glass once I'm done with this. And some green onions. And this is the batch of sweet basil that I'm going to harvest and crumble up and, you know, do, it, do, the, do the thing and get it, get it in storage. All right, now we can come back to what's for dinner. I got some boneless, skinless chicken. I'm using sour cream instead of the uh, plain yogurt that is called for. for. The only reason is, is because I don't want to buy a 32-ounce container of plain yogurt, which I don't eat, and Robin's free gets it's in the fridge. Lemon juice. Now, this is the fun part. There's garam masala, turmeric. I'm using a red chili powder from India, cardamom, oh, what else is here, cumin, coriander, and cinnamon from Indon it's Indonesian cinnamon. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and some a sliced red onion. Ah, that's the first part. That's the marinade. <laughs> then we have ghee, ginger, garlic, heavy whipping cream, a small tin of tomato sauce or puree, and just a little bit of sugar. Here is the black dough. As you can see, it's soaking. Um, I had to top off the water this morning. And this also will have some of the spices and goodies from this side, like the garam masala and the coriander. And yeah, there's, yeah. So we have actually cumin seed. These nice dried little chilies and some tomato. And I will probably add some diced onion to this. Wow. Mouthful. <laughs> Big time mouthful. All right. On this Saturday, this house is going to smell fantastic in a little while. Because as soon as I get this video up and, and where it needs to go, I need to get this marinade. Just chicken in the marinade. So... On this Saturday, have a great day, eat great food, and have fun cooking.